Well, didn't get off. I hit. I can still got them on. This is number 12 today. In the first spot I went, I, my favorite spot, I caught nothing for 15 minutes. I was going to leave, and I caught four in a row. So, sometimes it pays to be a little persistent. You know there's fish there. But I'm not getting them on spoon spray. They're all biting on soft plastic. So this is a... <laughs> Get him in here. You can see that he's eating that ribster. Well, it didn't take very long. I've had about four bites I missed. I think it must be a real little one that was pecking at it. Now this is number 13. Whoa! <laughs> oh yeah, that's a little better. <laughs> better net him. I'm going to break my jig off. There we go. About a 16 incher. Nice one. Get on that ribster. Well, they quit biting, so I've been dragging, real slow, dragging my plastic on top of this reef, and that seems to be working. Got another one on. The 18. Oh, well, he still counts. That's close enough. Huh, there he is. He's still in the water. Maybe he'll bite again. That was 18. No, 19. 19. Well, things have slowed down, but I finally got another one. Moved to a different part of this reef. That's a pretty good one there. That's 20. It's been a long time. So we'll get her in and let her go and try for another. fish and let it go and there was a whole bunch more down there and I just dropped straight down and got this biggest one of the day and there's a bow. But that's pretty normal this time of year especially. They, uh, you catch one and a whole bunch more follow it in. Now I don't see any under the boat. So I'll throw this one back and see if uh, any more show up. Just to be safe, I'll go straight down again. No sense casting if you don't have to, huh? I guess. Well, I caught at least 10 fish here and they quit. I know they're still down there, so I tied on a 1 8 ounce little marabou crappie jig. First cast, another fish. They just got fussy. I caught all the dumb ones first. Let's see if I can. 
show you that bait. Just a little crappie jig. But a lot of times when they get fussy, you just put on one of them and you can catch several more fish if they're already there and just being fussy. Well, I've made three casts with this crappie jig and caught a fish on every cast. So, they've been here, they just got fussy. You're going to look at this bait and you're going to think there's nothing would bite on it. But three in a row. There it is. Not hardly anything to it, but for some reason it looks like a bug, I guess. Want to get fussy, go a little. Well, I didn't catch one on the fourth cast. But this is the fifth cast. And I got no. It's amazing. You think they're all you've caught every one. I caught at least ten on plastics. Put on that and start biting. Well, we're still biting them. The only thing you'll bite on now is this little crappie jig. 48 coming in here. I can get him in. But I must have caught way over a dozen on this thing since I put it on. Most of the hair's chewed off. <laughs> but they're still biting on it. So I've tried to plastics a few times since then, but not a bite, so all they want is that little bitty thing. Well, it's getting late. Yeah. This is 66 fish right here. I caught 57 bass before I caught a walleye today, and the walleyes I got were Dinks. Most of the bass have not been that big either, about two pounds to two and a half, a couple of threes, nothing real big. This one swallowed it. Well, this is 67. This is a nice one here. Might be the biggest one of the day. I moved over and started fishing a point. Oh yeah, this is a nice one here. Oh, got him in just in time. Oh, he's got a. Look at there, he's got a big old wart on his lips. You see that? <laughs> that looks like one my buddy Herb would catch. Big old ugly thing. About 18 inches though. Measure him up here. Oh heck, he more than 18. 19 inches. Nice one. Biggest one of the day, 19 inches. 